my name is Vikas and welcome back to our channel. So today we are going to learn about move command. So basically this command is under surface tab and it is here. So it says like offset, translate or rotate face or feature on a solid or surface model. So basically this command is used to move the whole surface from one point to another point. So let's see how it is like beneficial for practical application as a CAD engineer or design engineer. So basically we will first see the draft of this sheet metal part. So let's open the draft file. Okay, here is the draft file. As you can see, there are like too many features on this sheet metal part, so like holes and cutouts and everything is there. So when we move this surface from this point to one inch, so it will like affect all the dimensions in the draft so let's see if we don't use the move command and if we use like extrude cut command so how it will affect the draft file of this file this cat file so let's open this and first i'm going to cut this surface from one inch using extrude cut command go to feature extrude cut select this okay Select this and this edge, make it collinear. Smart dimensioning, give a dimension of one inch to the surface. Exit sketch. Okay, like select through all. Okay, so basically we have reduced this sheet metal part length by one inch. So if we have to update the drawing also so let's see how it will affect into the drawing so open it as you can see clearly here like it is dangled or the original position is shifted by one inch so it is not updated when we update it it will not take the update so this is the problem as a CAD engineer or design engineer like we need to update all the holes positions and everything so to reduce this effort and to save the time basically we use the move command so let's see how it works open the file okay first suppress this cut okay now we have a fresh model so go to surface tab here it is move command select this now we have to move the all surfaces toward the upward side by one inch so select this faces as you can see there is an option so I have selected translate option here and it is like select the surface which we want to translate so I am selecting these surfaces here okay this and this so we have a direction sign also here so we need to move this in upward direction so i have shifted a bit and we can see there is an option like we can edit the shift dimension so i'm interested to shift it by one inch so i'm selecting one enter okay so now this whole surface this whole surfaces are shifted by one inch so let's see save this file and go to the drawing open the drawing so let's see how it it will affect the drawing so as you can see when we use the move command the dimensions are stable and it is not dangled and the reference are still there because we move the surface we haven't cut the surface so that's why there is no dangle or no reference which is missed in drawing also so that's the reason why we use the move command so thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, please like, comment, share and subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thank you very much.